welcome to the Hero Challenge live from Abu Dhabi. Yes. Over the next hour, six of the biggest names in golf will battle it out on our specially constructed 100-yard hole that we've built here at the iconic Yas Marina F1 circuit. This incredible location usually plays host to adrenaline-fueled clashes where the slightest mistake can prove costly, and tonight is no exception. Yeah, that's right, Iona, and thanks to the backing of Hero, and in particular, their CEO and chairman, Dr. Pavan Munjal, tonight is the first of five Hero Challenge events this year. The winners of events one to four, plus two wild cards, will qualify for the grand final, which takes place in Dubai at the end of the season, just before the DP World Tour Championship. But back to tonight, whether you're watching on your phone, your TV, or even on Twitter, you're in for a great show, and here's how it works. The six players have been split into two groups of three based on their official World Golf rankings. At the end of round one, the winner of each group will go straight through to the semi-finals. The other two face a playoff to decide who joins them. The winners of the two semis will go head-to-head -head in the final to be crowned tonight's champion. Iona, this is your first Hero Challenge. Look at it. What it's, do you think? Oh, it's absolutely incredible. I have watched it on TV, Vernon, and I thought, that looks pretty good, but in person, it's much more intimidating, and I'm glad I'm in the commentary box. It's really, really difficult. All right, Iona, you mentioned the commentary box. Off you go. I think you're going to go and sit in the audience. I believe I am. Give her a big round of applause, everyone. Iona Stephen. So the time for talking is over. We've got a world-class location, and it's time to meet tonight's world-class players. First up, it's the guys in Group 1. It is unbelievable. It is unbelievable. Wonderful performance. There it is, Danny Willett. The comeback is complete. Well, this day of surprises just goes on and on. Put your hands together for Brooks Kepka, Bert Wiesberger, and Danny Willett. All right, Brooks, we'll come to you. Brooks Kepka, world number one. World number one golfer, Brooks Kepka. Brooks Kepka, you are the best golfer in <laughs> the world. Does it ever, 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 ever any, get any better than hearing those words? No, you can say it again if you want. <laughs> yeah, Brooks Kepka, <laughs> world number one. No, it's, uh, it's a good feeling. It really is. It's fun. It's, I'm enjoying it while I can. You never know how long it's going to last. And, um, you know, hopefully, hopefully it continues. And hard work pays off, right? Yes, it does. It does. Now, uh, your golfing career, you have a special place in your heart for the European Tour, don't you? Because you started Champions Tour and then the European Tour, and it, your career has gone on and it's kicked on and risen ever since. Yeah, honestly, the Challenge Tour playing uh, was the most fun I've ever had. Uh, you know, coming up through the ranks and then getting the European Tour and then going back to the States, uh, and there's nothing like it. So it's always always nice to get back over here to the European Tour and play. It's, uh, you know, kind of our second home. All right, it's nice to have you with us, Brooks. Thanks. Brooks Kapka, ladies and gentlemen, come on. Yes. Will cut free. Bert Wiesberger, welcome back to the Hero Challenge. Three victories last year on the European Tour. Surely you've raised the bar for yourself. You've got to keep that momentum going in 2020. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been here at the Hero Challenge. Did the first couple, but uh, good to be back. Awesome setup. Yeah, and um, last year was pretty good, so... Uh, enjoyed our time out there, a couple of wins, and uh, yeah, did well. Fast cars and fast golf, that's what it's all about tonight. Danny, last time you did the Hero Challenge, you came second, so close, so close in Dubai. Do you think you can snatch it tonight? No, we'll see. Good competition tonight, eh? so we'll, uh, we'll see. Really good competition. And gentlemen, let's not forget that this week it's the Abu Dhabi HSBC Championship. Are you all set? Are you all ready to go? All prepared, Brooks? I hope so. <laughs> it's a little late now, but um, yeah. It's, uh, it's exciting, obviously, having three months off. It uh, wasn't ideal, but uh, ready to go, and it'll be a fun week. Have you got rid is. of the uh, Christmas turkey? No, 
no. Oh, it's been a while. Right. Fair enough. At least you're honest. I like that, Brooks. Very good. Uh, ladies and gents, let's hear it for Brooks Kepka, Bert Wiesberger, and Danny Willett. So, gentlemen, in round one, you'll each have 60 seconds to hit up to six balls at our target, which is approximately 100 yards away. You'll score 5, 10, 25 and 50 points, depending on where the ball ends up, where it finishes. It's not about where it lands, it's about where it finishes. If you miss the target, you'll score zero points. Danny, you're up first. You've got your club. What have you chosen? 55. A 55. All right. Bert and Brooks, if you'd like to go and stand by the side. Danny, you know what to do when you give me the nod. Six balls. We will start the 60 seconds. Six balls. Oh, High score of the three automatically goes through to the semi-final. The other two will go into a playoff to decide who joins that gentleman. All right, Danny, you've got your ball set up. Tell me when you're ready. It's 60 seconds. I've never it's seen that before, Danny. It's quick, isn't it? I've never, ever seen that before. You're the first person that's lined them up like that. What, not straight? Yeah, usually we have them this way. You've done it that way. I like that. Tactics. OK, Danny, you ready? It's actually too close to that, isn't it? <laughs> Danny Willett, your 60 seconds. Yeah. Start. No. He's got his 55-degree wedge. And it's hopped on. Ten points on the board. Thank you very much. He's not hanging around. Take your time, Danny. There we go, that's more like it. Two previous Hero Challenge appearances, and he made it to the final in Dubai. But he's on the run. He's got a bit left. He's only got one ball left. 20 points on the board. He's got to make this one count. Has he done it? And he has. Very good. Okay. Yes, really well done, Danny. Start. You scored 30 points. <laughs> 30 points. Not you flew enough. through that. What was the tactics behind that? You could have taken your turn. It feels like it should be a lot quicker, but it's not, is it? You have 20 seconds left. Can you believe it? Can 20 seconds. No, you can't have any more. Uh, Danny, thank you very much. If you'd like to go and join the gentleman, uh, let's, uh, let's welcome Bert. Come on, then. You've got 30 points to beat, OK? You've got 60 seconds. And as we saw from Danny's attempt, you've got a lot of time. A minute is actually a lot of time. Yeah. So when you're ready, when you're set up, let me know and we'll start the clock. All right. All right. Are you ready? Your 60 seconds. Start. No. Here he goes, Brian Wiesberger, number 23 in the world rankings. The Austrian from Vienna, what's he got tonight? And he's started well. Five points. Consistency is key in the Hero Challenge. That'll do. He doesn't need to go quite as quickly as Danny Willett went, but he is going fairly fast. He's the most successful Austrian golfer ever to play on the European Tour and had a fantastic season last year. Yes. yes! We like that. 25 points. Thank you very much. Leader in the clubhouse. Oh, he's dialed in, Iona. He's doing well, looking very smooth. But it doesn't surprise me. He's a man in form. Lovely! Very <laughs> strong performance. What did you do wrong in the first two, then? I thought there was wind left to left, clearly not. It, 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 it's quite deceiving because we are in a little bowl, so the wind kind of swirls around. All right, I can tell you, Bert, that you managed to score 50 points. All right. Well done, that's pretty good. You don't look that happy. It's better than Danny's score. I haven't, I haven't done that challenge yet, so I'm, I, don't, I don't know what's, what's good and what's bad, so <laughs> right, okay. I'll, I'll watch Fair number enough. one and then, uh, then judge. Honest. Yeah, let's see yeah. what the world's number one golfer could do. Leslie Edelman, Brooks Kapka. I think, Brooks, earlier on I said you're on the Champions Tour. That's for the old boys, you're on the Challenge uh, Tour. That's not right. that old, yeah. yeah. I know. <laughs> Maybe later. I know, I was like, no, that's wrong. Uh, OK, so, you know what to do. You've seen what the guys have done. I have. If you get more than 50 points, you're straight through to the semis. All right. Are you feeling the pressure, Brooks? Massively. The wind is swirling. <laughs> <laughs> the Are point. you ready? Yeah, let's you're go. Your 60 seconds, start, no. Here he is, Brooks Kepka, world number one. Yeah, strong great start. start. Now you can't see it okay, by the good, flag, but there is wind. 25 points. 
few more of them will do. Thank you very much. Very strong start. Seven PGA Tour wins, four of the majors. Loves the majors, does Brooks. And I'm sure he cares for the Hero Challenge just as seriously as he does for those. Typical specimen, isn't he? Yeah, Look at those forearms. Looking very, very good. Five, five, five. Short, Brooks. Just short there. Five seconds. Landed on the, on the five. A few more points to get him into the semis. Yes. There he is. All right. 70 points straight through to the semi finals. Congratulations, Brooks. Awesome. <laughs> was, yeah, I thought I looked good at the first one. I thought I did it. And I was like, oh. After six, all right, all right, I'll take it. You were very lucky because one did bounce on the track and then onto the target, but uh, it got you five points, so congratulations. It doesn't matter now because you are through to the semi-final. These two guys are going to battle it out in our playoffs. So, Brooks, if you'd like to step to one side, not world's number one golfer, thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> nice thing Danny, you're, it does. Uh, Danny, you're going to go first. This time it's a little bit different. You've got less time. You've got 30 seconds and you've got three balls. The person who scores the most will join Brooks in the semi-final. So, Danny, are you ready? No. <laughs> You've got no choice, my friend. This wind is swirling, eh? It is swirling. The wind is swirling. Get the excuses in early. All right, you ready, Dan? Yeah. Your 30 seconds start now. 30 seconds on the clock, but three balls only this time. And this is the first time we've done this format. Take your time. In the Hero Challenge. Off. Second bite of the cherry to get through to the semi finals. Nil point. He's wearing white. He's wearing white when he won the Masters in 2016. Five points. Yeah. Can he win here tonight? This ball really needs to count. And it does. Yeah! Really? Yeah. He's got a total of 15 points, Dan. <laughs> All right. Half me six. <laughs> so you've got 15 to beat, Bert. All right. And then you will join Brooks Kepka in the semi final. You ready? Let's get him off the stage first. Yeah. Right, I'm ready. Okay. Your 30 seconds start now. Frank Wiesberger, the Austrian. Two previous Hero Challenge appearances, but has yet to make it to a final. It's a strong ball. Yes! The oh, I'm loving that one. Done 25. It. Perfect. <laughs> easy peasy. Awesome. Bert, you won the playoff. Congratulations, right, gentlemen. I'll Come on in. I'll, I'll, I'll Come let on him in. practice my two. He only needed. One ball. All right. Must be lucky, Dan. Thank you. So close yet so far away. Mike. Miles away. A little bit like the last time you did it in Dubai. <laughs> Commiserations. Brooks, congratulations. You're the winner. Danny, au revoir. Uh, but Same you're going to join yeah. Brooks in join the semi final. So congratulations Lovely. to you both. Ladies and gentlemen, give them a big round of applause. Brooks Kepke, Danny Willett, and Bert Wiesberger. There's plenty more where that came from, because after the break, the players in Group 2 will be battling it out for the rights to face these guys in the semis. We'll find out who it's going to be after this. Welcome back to the Hero Challenge, live from the Yas Marina F1 circuit in Abu Dhabi. Now, before the break, we saw Brooks Kepka and Bert Wiesberger qualify for their semi-finals. It's now time to meet the three players in Group 2 who are hoping to join them. Absolutely magnificent. That is absolutely brilliant. Wonderful performance. Let's hear it for Louis Oosthuizen, and Matt Fitzpatrick and Victor Hovland. I'll be honest with you, the reason why I'm laughing is because we had the first group come out and they were all golf and they were all professional. 
This looks like a Sunday roll-up. Victor, you're wearing <laughs> jeans, and Louis, you're wearing <laughs> jeans. Yeah. I like it. It's fun. I guess this is what makes the Hero Challenge a little bit different, right? Oh, yeah. No, this, this was a lot of fun, and we just hope to get a few good shots. <laughs> <laughs> Fingers crossed. You've got to avoid the fast car, OK, because that's quite expensive. It's not a prize. It's just an expensive car sat there. Uh, Louis, congratulations. Great start to 2020. Great performance in South Africa. A hole in one. Yeah, um, I did push it quite a little bit because uh, there was definitely not the line to go on that hole, but um, luckily I had the right club. <laughs> There's never, ever, ever an excuse for getting a holding one. No, no, on that one it is. If you see where that pin was, um, that was definitely not a pin to go to. <laughs> oh, well, congratulations. Uh, the Abu Dhabi HSBC Championship presented by EGA is this week. Does that performance in South Africa really kick you on for this week? Are you confident? Yeah, I mean, um, it's a big week. It's always a nice week to come and play. It's a great golf course and um, just ready to start the year. And obviously getting ready because you're wearing jeans, hoping that one day golf will allow us to wear jeans on the course. <laughs> We've got shorts already, so we, uh, yeah, who knows? You know, hopefully we get into jeans. <laughs> who knows? Uh, Matt, welcome back. Thank you. You've been victorious in the past at the Hero Challenge. I have, yeah. This one's a little different. Yeah. A little bit different to the conditions when you win it because we were in Scotland and it was absolutely chucking it down. Yes. Yeah, it was about minus 10 as well. Yeah, <laughs> but uh, are you riding high, feeling confident because your team, uh, Sheffield United, in the English Premier League are also doing exceptionally well? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, it's, it's great to see. You know, it's been a good start. Hopefully they can keep it up. Fingers crossed. Victor, welcome. Thank you. Welcome. Can I just say it's an honour to have you with us because there's so much talk about you and your new career uh, in the world of golf. Everyone's saying that you're going to make a huge impact. Do, do you carry that burden on your shoulders? Hopefully in a positive way, right? Yeah, no, definitely. definitely. No, uh, I, I just try to have fun and try to work on my game, and we'll see how it goes. All right, well, fingers crossed. Good luck. Thank you. So, gentlemen, uh, ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Louis Ustays and Matt Fitzpatrick and Victor Hovland. <laughs> right, Victor, you're up first. So, Louis and Matt, if you go and step to one side, it's exactly the same as what we saw the previous group do. You've got 60 seconds to hit six balls. The person who scores the most of the three will automatically go through to the semi-finals, and then the other two will compete in a playoff. Perfect. When you're ready, Victor, give me the nod. Age before beauty, gentlemen. No offence. Are you ready, Victor? Yes, sir. OK, your time starts now. Well, here we go at 22. This kid is the real deal, total star in the making, both on and off the golf course. And he's five on the points. points. He's on the board, five points. Settles the nerves, gets points in early. From Oslo in Norway. Looks like he's made it, yes, 10 points. It's a strong start. He's got laser focus. Oh, sweet. Half his time to go. Look at that, so smooth. Got it dialed in. Take your time, Victor. Easy peasy. Turned pro just last year. Having been studying at Oklahoma State University. And he's hot property, to say the very least. Last ball. Scored with everyone. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> 70 points. It's not too and shabby. You've raised an awesome bar that the other two have got to get over. That's, a, that's an awesome performance. Congratulations, Victor. You. If you'd like to um, join the other two, Matt, you're up next. That was a good performance from the young lad. Yeah, that was that was impressive. Yeah, yeah the pressure is on your shoulders, Matt, as a former winner of the Hero Challenge. Yeah. Uh, same rules apply. Line up your balls, 60 seconds, six shots. As many points as possible. Remember, you've got as much time as you'd like to prepare. Good to go. Are you ready, Matt? OK, yeah, yeah. your time starts now. Well, he's been here before. He's familiar with the hero challenge. The Englishman. Oh, that's not. Bounced off the back, that, Matt. Uh, bounced off the back. See where that went. 25 years old and ranked 25 in the world. OK, on the board. Five points. Five European Tour wins. Oh, dear. This is not what I expected from Matt. He's got to make these last few 
golf tank. And he does. Oh! It's more like it, 30 points. He's the youngest Englishman to win five European titles at just 24 years old. What kind of kick was that? 55, 60 points, Matt, 60 points. Pretty good, it's only 10 behind Victor. It's a really, really good performance. Don't, don't, <laughs> down on yourself. <laughs> Come on, Matt. All right, you go and join Victor. <laughs> Louis, that is a strong look, my friend. You that is so absolute that perfection. <laughs> Have you got your mobile in your back pocket as well? Yeah. Yeah, love it. A very cool, <clears throat> calm and collected character, Louis Oosthuizen. 75 will get you through to the semi-final. Are you ready? I'm going to throw the grass for the wind. All anyway, right. okay, Louis, I'm ready. Louis, you go ahead. Your time starts now. Here he is, the South African. What a lovely swing. Probably the most, if, well, actually, the most popular swing on tour. Everyone wants to swing it like Louis. He makes this game look very easy. It's a shy start. But the middle to trouble it there too and he does yeah. oh, no. 50 points that's the way to do it first 50 pointer of the night <laughs> <laughs> one more 50 pointer and that'll be easy game he turned pro in 2002 so he's been out here a while now last oh. year oh, bouncing down the formula one track towards the runners and the cyclists in the background there we go. Yeah. It's a good score. Louis, you are through to the semi final with 90 points. Congratulations. Great scoring. Thank you. Uh, let's talk about the, uh, the conditions quickly, Louis. Can you, is there a lot of wind out there? Um, I don't know. <laughs> it looks that way on the one I nearly hit the car. But you made it look yeah. really easy. Congratulations. You're through to the semi final. If you'd like to step to one side, Louis, give him a big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Louis, who stays, he's in the semi final. All right, Matt. Victor, you know what you've got to do. It's a playoff. You've got 30 seconds. You've got three balls each. Highest score will join Louis in the semi final. All right, Matt. You, can, you go first if you want. I'll, I'll go. All right, good man. Lay your cards face up on the table. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for Matt Fitzpatrick. Are you ready, Matt? Okay, your 30 seconds start now. Here he goes, Matt. What's he got? Three balls. Got to make them count. Ooh. First time we've ever done this at the Hero Challenge, giving the players a second bite. And do you know, Matt Fitzpatrick, he has got steely competitive, not competitiveness running through him, so I wouldn't be surprised if he throws something out of the bag here. Last ball, it's really got to count. It's a good number. Well, it's a number. Oh. And it just goes. 10 points. You scored 10 points, Matt. All right, Victor. Come on up, in your jeans. Nice jeans on. Thank you. Okay, same as always, 30 seconds, three balls, 20 or more will get you into the semi-final with Louis. Set yourself up. Let's do it. Okay, your 30 seconds start now. Former world amateur number one golfer, Victor Hovland. Three balls, can he make it to the semi-final? the Hero Challenge here in Abu Dhabi. It looks like he might... That's it! Yeah. That's it! <laughs> <laughs> yes! You only needed one ball, 25 points. Congratulations. Oh, look at the young guy. Uh, I like that, showing your, your, your confidence, like a peacock showing his feathers. Uh, congratulations, Victor and Louis. You are through to the semi-final. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a bid farewell to Matt Fitzpatrick. Give him a big round of applause. Thank you very much. So, we now know those all-important semi-final lineups. First up, it's Brooks Kepka against Victor Hovland. That'll be a good one. And then it's Louis Oosthuizen versus Bert Wiesberger. Join us in a couple of minutes for both of those mouth-watering clashes. We'll see you then. Welcome back to the Hero Challenge, where it's time for the semi-finals. First up, it's Brooks Kepka 
against Victor Hovland. This is going to be a real, real, real interesting contest. World number one against the rookie that everyone is talking about. Only started his professional career last year. It's going to be awesome, this matchup. Then it's Louis Oosthuizen versus Bert Wiesberger. Looking forward to that one as well. The format of the semi-finals is slightly different. This time, you'll have six shots, but we're going to alternate. You understand? So Louis, you'll take a shot, and then Bert, you'll take a shot. Simple as that. Whoever scores the most points goes through to the final, and the loser is out. As we know, semi-final one is between Brooks and Victor. Brooks, you won the group, so you're going to get to choose whether you go first or second. Uh, I'll go second. You're going to go second. OK, Victor, you step up to the tee box. <laughs> Scared. He's let the young guy go first. I like that. OK, thank you, Louis. Thank you, Bert. So we're going to alternate this time, Victor, which means you go first, then Victor, oh, okay, then uh, yeah. Bert goes... Uh, sorry, beg your pardon. Uh, Brooks goes second, all right? Gotcha. We're not, we're not against the clock, so you can take your time. Well, we're not against the clock here, as Vernon says. But I've got a feeling they won't mess around, and this is certainly some match. The former world amateur number one. Good start. Playing against the current world number one, Brooks Kapka, And who is gonna come out on top? Brooks Kapka opting to go second. He clearly wants to win this. Wanted to know what he had to beat. Oh, short. short. And I tell you what, there's a big gust of wind just blown into the marina. <laughs> Hard to see because the flag's below us here, but where we are in the stand, it is really swirling around. And it's great to see Victor looking so relaxed, clearly not intimidated by playing against the current world number one. There he is again. <laughs> He's making this look so easy. Fearless from the young guy. Only 22, but let's see what Brooks can do. Oh, oh he likes it. Great bounce. <laughs> oh, he's coming out with all the excuses. He hasn't been competitive in over three months, Brooks Kepka. And this is the perfect place to start, I think. Here at the Hero Challenge, get it dialed in again. Find some sharpness in the game from 100 yards. Sir Hoffman. There he is again. Easy peasy. He's yet to hit a ball that hasn't scored points. 60 to 5. This is starting to heat up. Halfway point, 30 points to separate them. But there is 50 points available out there with one ball. Just got to find it. I would not write off Brooks Kepka at this stage. But Victor Hoffman, there he is again. Consistency. Give you a window. <laughs> to say the very least. And we see that in his game. He's just got this marvellous presence and focus when he plays golf. A little bit long. OK, we've got two balls left. It's 35 to Brooks Kepka and 70 to Victor Hovland. back to Victor. What can he do with his last two shots? Love the way he swings the club. Once again. In the red zone. 25 points. Obviously just touching enough to get the high number. Bruce Kepka got to make this count. Not want to lose to the rookie. It's too strong. It's those forearms, I told you. Needs to stop going to the gym. One ball left. 
showboating now from Victor. Every single ball completely dialed in. Oh, oh. there we go. 105. <laughs> I'm afraid there aren't enough points out there for Brooks. But he's a pleasure to watch anyway. We're thrilled he's come to join us here at the Hero Challenge. Oh. <laughs> Come on in, Brooks. Come on in, Victor. Uh, the young book has beaten the world number one. Yeah. He's, a, he's a pretty decent player, right? Yeah, he's not too bad. <laughs> he's not too bad. No, he's good. He's fun. Yeah. Hey, good shots. Yeah, 105 to 45. Congratulations, we Victor. Have... Uh, your debut on the Hero Challenge and you're into the final. Ladies and gentlemen, give them both a big round of applause. Victor and Brooks. All right, Louis, Bert. Okay, Louis, you won the group earlier on, which means you get to decide whether you want to go first or second. I'll go first. I'm going to go first. It didn't work for Brooks going second. It didn't I'll work for Brooks at all. Uh, okay, now the wind's picked up a little bit, which means it's going to be a little bit more difficult. You talked about it earlier on, uh, so maybe you might have to rethink your shot. But Louis, if you'd like to stand sure. up on the mat, we're going to alternate. Oh, alternate, yeah. Six balls each. Highest score will join Victor in the final. Take your time, Louis. Well, here we go. The second semi-final. Louis stays in, in his denim, starting us off. Five points. OK, points is all we need. Victor Hovland proved that consistency does matter. If every ball has a number, you're not in a bad position. Wow. Wow. Very good start from the Austrian. Ten points. Back to our 2010 Open champion. He's got nine European Tour wins, does Louis Stazen? And actually four holes in one, including last week. That's more like it. They both enjoy playing out here in the desert in Abu Dhabi. <laughs> and this man won two Rolex events last year and he's here for the first one of the 2020 season. Oh, oh dear, that's just skittled off the front. Back to Louis on his Hero Challenge debut. Coming up short. Oh! oh. No! <laughs> <laughs> Luckiest five points you'll see tonight. <laughs> So at the halfway point, Bert's got 20. Louis's got 20. Oh, oh lovely. More like it. They find the rhythm now. Both with such rhythmical swings. Who can find the 50? That's what we want to see. We want a 50 pointer. It's not easy to judge it. The green's downhill a little bit, and the wind is swirling in this hairpin bend. That sounded good. It looks good. It's got the distance. Perfect distance. Just a little bit left. We need something special here from Burned. Time to get it dialed in. Holding the finish. Oh gosh, just trickles outside. The green slopes slightly from back to front. 
25 or better, and he has won through to the final. What's it going to be? Oh! 25! Go on, Bert, we'll let you have this last one. We'll let you have this last one. He could, he could get 50 time. points. Oh, you're right. Yes, you're right. How dare I? Yeah, 50, 50 points. points. You could tie it up. It didn't matter. Oh. It didn't matter. Five points. It wasn't to be. You got five. It didn't matter. Uh, congratulations, Louis. You are through to the final. But it's always good to see you. Good luck this week. Uh, yeah, good luck. So let's hear it for Louis Oosthuizen and Bert Wiesberger, everyone. Thank you. So it's Victor Hovland. See you later. It's Victor Hovland against Louis Oosthuizen in the first Hero Challenge of 2020. And it's live in just a couple of minutes. Welcome back to the Hero Challenge here at the Yas Marina Circuit in Abu Dhabi. I don't know whether you can see this, but every couple of days, the track is opened up and people are allowed to run around it or cycle around it. It's amazing. 5K is the length of the track, and if you choose to ride your bike or running, it's absolutely free. I think it's a real good incentive to get people fit and up and about. Uh, please welcome back onto the stage, Victor Hovland against Louis Oosthuizen. <laughs> <laughs> Victor, were you signing off after that? I was. Good man. Louis was kind enough to give me a Sharpie, so deep fly. <laughs> well, he's got a Sharpie in his back pocket because prior to coming out and playing some golf, he was doing some DIY in his jeans uh, earlier on. It's a good, strong look, Louis. I've said it before, I'll say it again. And actually, actually, we've made a statement this evening because both of you are in the final and both of you are wearing jeans. There you go. There you go, smart casual. Uh, OK, well, let's go over to our uh, other contestants, shall we say. We'll start with Brooks. Brooks, who do you think is going to win out of the young buck and the old guard? I'll go Louis. Got to go Louis? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, one for Louis. He's only Vic jealous that you so beat him. He beat me so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Danny, who do you think is going to win out of these two? I'll keep it politically correct and go, Victor. Go 50-50. All right, 50-50. As always. Sympathy vote. Will it sitting on the fence? Matt Fitzpatrick, who do you think is going to win? Uh, I think it's going to be Victor. Victor? He's gone for Victor as well. Bert? He had a, he had a good six balls, Victor. I'll go with Victor as well, I think. Oh, Ooh, three to one, OK. Uh, Victor, you're the favourite out of your uh, fellow professionals. Louis, what do you think about that? Uh, well, that's a, the reason is they're standing over there, so I'm going <laughs> to listen to them. But, yes, yeah, throwing some go. fire. I like that, Louis. Uh, OK, Louis, you are uh, going to go first. You're going to get a choice whether you go first or second because you're all the highest-ranked players. you want to go first or I'll second? I'll go first. You're going to go yeah. first? All right, fair well, enough. Sure you're you're not going. scared. Yeah. Victor, <laughs> if you'd like to go and join the people that believe in yeah. you... OK, the plebs uh, over here. That's fine, your fan club over there. All right, Louis, this is how it's going to work. It's exactly the same as the semi-final. We're going to alternate shots. However, the last ball is going to be worth double points. So if it lands in the 50, you'll get 100 points. And we know all too well that that last ball is really, really important. Remember, whoever wins tonight automatically qualifies for the Hero Challenge Series finale in Dubai at the end of the year. All right, Louis, you are feeling confident. You've come in your jeans. You're in the final. In your own time. Here we go. The first Hero Challenge final of 2020. And it must be the adrenaline, because that's gone off the back. It's just a little nerves. Man. It's just a little nerves. <laughs> Victor Holland, I think he's going to be extremely tough to beat. He looks so dialed in. And he's incredibly focused. All the guys having a great time here tonight at the Formula One track. Here we go. Ooh. He's going for the hole. All day, all day. The target's easy for Victor now. It's the hole he's aiming for. I'm just gonna, I'm waiting so he's on got the to answer ball. back. Claimed an emotional victory in 2019, which broke an air three-year drought of wins when he won the South African Open. Oh, oh no. Oh, and it's another member's bank. Five points. Yes, five points by the skin of his teeth, back to Victor. Already with a 20-point lead. 
Victor does not look like he's going to miss. It's another smooth swing. Wind's blowing. Very good. He's yet to hit a ball that does not score. It's incredible stuff. An absolute exhibition <laughs> from the young player. And here's Louis. What can he do? Okay. Oh, just gone. Ten. <laughs> That's him at his halfway point. He's got to hope Victor loses his rhythm somehow, but I can't see that happening. to be done. If anyone can, he can. So smooth. Another great bounce. <laughs> Victor Hovland. He won the low am at both the Open and the US Open in 2019, and it's clear to see why. Oh. Making this look easy. Oh, it's getting a nervous, 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 nervous <laughs> that, yeah. Two balls left each, 30 points between yeah. them. <laughs> He's calling for it to go. Oh, oh, Louis, come on! Not enough to join the cyclists. <laughs> Still having a good time, it's so great to see. Don't forget, there are a hundred points on offer for the last ball of this final, which keeps the match alive. Oh dear, that's another fantastic shot. Louis is in big trouble now, big, big trouble. And the crowd Louis, is this together. is your last ball, it's worth double points. <laughs> Yeah, good luck. Hit the last one. Okay. This could be <laughs> big. Find the 50, Louis. <laughs> you can stop the giggles. Oh. No, it's oh. not bad. It's not a bad effort. It's looking concerned. It's not good enough for victory, but Victor, we're going to let you take your final ball. Okay. Let's see what score you come up with. Remember, this is worth double. Do I go for the car in front or? Don't go for the car. <laughs> Don't go for the car. If you, Victor, if you were a veteran on tour and you'd banked some cash, I would let you go for the car because you could afford to pay for the damage. However, however, it's the start of your career. Go for the bullseye, please. Okay, okay. Hit, for, hit the 50, then get 100 points. Avoid the Formula One car, that's what we ask. Scores with this ball, that would be every single one. Oh, and there you go. What a guy, what a goal for Come on in, guys. Second. Come on in, come on in, come on in. <laughs> wow. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Victor Hovland. Victor, that was outrageous. I've got to ask you, Victor, it, obviously this week you're going to lay up to exactly the same yardage because those shots were superb. Yeah, I, I think I just need to carry around a mat on the course. <laughs> it's just what I grew up on, so I feel right at home. Awesome performance. Gentlemen, you were right. Uh, well, three of you were right. He did become victorious. <laughs> over Louis Oosterzen. I think the winner tonight, Louis, is your jeans. Thank you. With a, a shadow of doubt. Uh, let's welcome the gentleman to present the trophy. Please welcome onto the stage the chairman, managing director and chief executive officer of the Hero Motor Corp, Dr. Pavan Munjal. Dr. Munjal, I've got to ask you a quick question. We've got five, well, we now have four Hero Challenge 
events this year. We've started off with an absolute superb, victorious young gentleman, Victor Horvath. Absolutely. This guy has been so consistent from the first shot that he hit. I was just telling my friend Brookie there that now I'm seeing him play for the first time. Well done. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> Appreciate if it. If you would like to present him with the trophy. Thank you. It was all luck. All luck. <laughs> Brooks, world number one. The world's number one golfer, ladies and gentlemen, Brooks Kepka. That's Brooks Kepka, the world's number one golfer, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Brooks, have you enjoyed yourself? <laughs> I had a great time. It was good. All right, good month. Louis disappointing me <laughs> my pick, but yeah. You're always welcome. Uh, Danny, Matt, Bert, good luck this week. Feeling confident? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it really is that simple. Uh, Dr. Munjal, I think we've raised the bar. The standard is very, very high. Where do we go next? Can you remember? I don't remember, but uh, I think it's uh, Europe. It is Europe. It's the British Masters at Close House. So we're going to enjoy that. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. Gentlemen, thank you so much for coming. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Matthew Fitzpatrick, Danny Willett, Bert Wiesberger, world's number one golfer, Brooks Kepka. <laughs> Louis Oosthuizen and of course Peter Hovland. Thank you very much for joining us. We will see you next time. Good night. another European tour video click here or to subscribe click here